This is Tao Talk, the Garden Grove TV3 News Report. Towering trees, bright, colorful flowers, drawing birds and butterflies, and zen like gardens. Beyond this white picket fence on Enalt Lane, you'll find the woods home, brimming with country charm. It's no wonder Garden Grove homeowners are being recognized for having the best looking homes and yards. For 38 years, the Schaefers have made a hobby out of grooming their garden and looking forward to springtime when everything is in bloom. Hundreds of homeowners built the community meeting center at the 42nd annual Garden Grove Pride Award Ceremony. Zone 7, Daryl and Patricia Peterson. Volunteer judges scoured these 17 zones to find the top homes in Garden Grove. We looked for different brickwork and their driveways maintained, their yards maintained. When we were driving by, we were just looking for something that had really good curb appeal that would stand out. Photos of the 17 Home of the Year winners were posted on the city's website so people could vote for the best looking home. This year's best home and garden goes to Patrick and Valerie Sullivan from Zone 16. Their sage-colored farmhouse-style home took eight years to remodel, but the Sullivans had no idea they'd be winners. Didn't expect it at all. I was greatly surprised because there's so many homes in the area and it, just, it would be hard to be a judge. One additional home was recognized as the best water-wise home. Kraft is proud to say he hasn't put a single drop of tap water on his yard this year. I think of how amazing it is and, I mean, not to brag, but I think I did a great job. This award showed the importance of conserving water and how maintaining drought-tolerant gardens can be just as beautiful. It's not just about saving water. There's much more to it than that. There's no mowing. There's no blowing. You're saving a lot of water. And it's also a habitat garden where you get the bugs and the butterflies and birds. At the end of the 42nd annual Garden Grove Pride Awards ceremony, all the very dedicated volunteers and Home of the Year winners were recognized for their hard work and creativity. This is Tao Talk reporting.